Each virtual mic is paired with a primary and secondary camera. If the primary camera is already in use, Automate VX will use the secondary camera in order to avoid broadcasting camera motion to the far end. If you turn on the shot visualization, you will be able to see the camera pairings on your design. You will notice that if you move either the cameras or the virtual mic, the shot visualization follows. Also, if you increase or decrease your shot width, the shot visualization will also change. If you would like to pair any virtual microphones together so that they have the same camera decision, you can simply link them together into what is called a super lobe. In order to create a super lobe, select the virtual microphone that you would like to use as the parent. Then click Modify Sublobes. Now you can click on each virtual mic you would like to be paired with the parent and then select Done. Now, if any of these virtual microphones trigger, Automate VX will use the camera shot for the parent mic.